joined by manager Danny Penswick after today's 4-0 defeat here at Earlham. Uh, Danny, uh, a promising first half performance, but second half just I'd describe it as dire, really. What are your thoughts? <laughs> Cheers. Um, first half was better, and I think overall, in terms of the game we've played, that's probably the best we've done. And whilst, whilst that's probably disrespecting ourselves a lot because we still weren't great today, it's better. It was better than last Saturday, better than the Saturday before, so we are getting there. For the first hour, I'd say we're in the game. You know, an unfortunate OG first half, and then second half, we're pushing on to try and get that equaliser. Once the second went in, um, we seem to uh, we seem to go to go to pop and um, defensively midfield our shape. Uh, there seems to be didn't seem to be that same desire that we had for the opening sixty. And yeah, dire. <laughs> <There it is. laughs> um, I thought first half particularly the the intensity first particularly first twenty, and then perhaps faded towards half time, but. The lads look fired up, fired up out there. Yeah, well, that's that's something we've asked, we've asked them to do a bit more because um, with all the talent we've got, we're not doing ourselves a, a, a service at the moment out on the pitch. So we wanted to get them fired up, and Tomo came in and helped us with a warm up that certainly enabled that. And, and the lads were raring to go, um, and we started off well. We started off well. Fortunately, once the goals went in, our, our heads dropped and we kind of lost that willingness and that desire to want to actually um, put the hard yards in and work hard for each other. And 4-0, and you could say flattered them, but it doesn't really matter. It's another defeat. It's another day we've conceded four and it's another day we go home and, and we have a long yard think about how we get better. Very encouraging performance from particularly the two centre-halves, Corey and Jordan, making his debut. Yeah, yeah, very happy. Jordan's 18, 19, Corey's 17, you know, two teenagers at the heart of our defence and, and to the credit they stood up really well. I thought they were strong in the air, they read the game well, they played when they could do and they were a real plus points for us today. Probably slightly harsh with Corey's OG at the end there and, and coming off playing centre half after having a good game, losing 4-0, it's, it's not gonna it's it's not a nice feeling, but they'll definitely come back stronger as of today and they're learning all the time and, and definite plus points to take. Just want to touch on the front three as well quickly. Very lively, particularly first half and for majorities of the second half, but just that touch too many perhaps and that trying to do it themselves perhaps one too many times and we could have been unfortunate with a few chances really. You're answering your own questions there, Mark. <laughs> no, um, all three of them are, are lively and, and they showed that. What, what happened the longer the game went on is they started to whether it's play for themselves or try and do it all themselves. and No one man can win a game of football. I, I don't care proving that with Messi at the moment, you know. He needed Neymar, he needed Suarez, he needed Iniesta all around him to make him the player he is. And at the moment, we've, we've got a few lads who, who think they can do it all on their own. And the harsh reality of football at this level is they can't. They have to work in a team and, and they may have to graft there for 80 minutes and one coming off their arse and they've had a good game. And that's it, they don't need to turn people inside out and back to front and every time they get the ball, pop it, get yourself in the box and, and do what gets your name in lights and score goals. Uh, look stronger with yourself in in midfield. Happy to be back playing in your in your natural position. I am, but I thought I was rubbish today. I mean, I know I know I wasn't rubbish, but in terms of the levels I expect from myself, I was way down. It's the first time I've played centre in a while, um, to be honest. So, I'll be better for the 90 minutes and the legs in there, getting getting used to your second balls. I mean, as, as harsh reality as it is, that's probably like a first pre-season game for me. And in there with where playing at centre half is a completely different ball game. So it was good to be back. It's where I want to play. Um, it's where I think I can help the team the most. And Corey and Jordan have done done everything to keep me in there, which is what I asked them to do. Don't don't give me the easy option to drop myself back to centre half. Make you two our uh, our, our centre half partnership and and go from there.